Hello, Darth Vegan here, back with another episode of Kerbal Space Program Season 4. I just now attempted to record me adding on this additional habitat module here to the, uh, actually it's right here, to the uh, orbital station around Kerbin. We had a mission to do so, and yeah, I never started the recording, so I did the entire episode um, without recording it, so... <laughs> <laughs> it was full of fun, believe me. So, now what we're going to do instead for this episode is we do have a mission here to rescue Asdus. Uh, As or is it Asdus? Asdus? Here. Asdus has uh, been stranded in the orbit of Kerbin, a relatively nice and easy rescue mission, and we happen to have a rescue craft here from our... We were going to use it as an escape pod for this station, but I think we will instead use it to rescue Mr. Man. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and s let's go ahead and detach it now here and decouple no beep. All right, and let's just make sure we can control this little guy. Oh yeah, he's he's easy. All right. So now I'm gonna set this guy as our target. Boop. There we go. And we are going to first set a maneuver node here, so that we can change our plane and get on the same orbital plane as him. That will make it easy to make an intersection. And boop. There we go. There's that, and then now, after we do that, oops, we can actually bring in our orbit so that an intersection will occur at some point. There we go. How's our plane now? Point one, that's still good. Okay. Okay, so we're going to do that, and uh, after we do that burn, oh, this thing showing no delta V, what the heck? Okay, we got plenty. <laughs> Tricked you. All right, let's uh, dad that down there. There we go. Now we're talking. All right, so after we do that little burn, then we should be able to um, uh, make some adjustments to our orbit, and then we can uh, rendezvous with this thing. So very good, nice start to a quick episode. This is unfortunately going to be quick because uh, used up. Uh, my recording time uh, not actually recording I, uh, let's just not talk about that anymore and let's see here ready for our burn in three two one burn bye bye station bye bye Javla see you next time all right there we go so now let's just Get this just right here don't really need to but I like to make it as close as possible well uh, as close as possible is a uh, is relative all right so now we've got a pretty big uh, difference in our orbits here as you can see and it will probably take many many orbits before we can actually get a nice intersection. Actually, it's not too bad. About four orbits. Let's see if we can, after four orbits, if we can clean that up a little bit. Let's see what we got. How about that right there? 2.1. How you like them apples? How about 1.0? Just a hint of under zero would be nice. Okay, there. Look at me go. Look at that speed. Okay, point two. That sounds pretty good, doesn't it? All right, so we do have to make several orbits, so that is not too bad, though. We're going to go ahead and warp around to do our maneuver, and I will see you guys in just a moment. Alright, so we have warped around, but then I noticed something. Uh, 
my maneuver node is taking us like well into the uh, atmosphere there, so that's not going to work. So I'm going to go ahead and kill that maneuver node. And we are going to have to make another maneuver so that uh, we do not dip into the atmosphere. So let's try this out here. That's the hard thing about these uh, rescue missions that are real close to Kerbin here. you got to really be careful of your... your your uh, maneuvers all right so let's see what we can do here that will not endanger the vessel at all here so let's see if we can go out here and get that going 67,000 a little too close for comfort buddy there a little too close for comfort but if we can get up uh, I think we can do that. I'm going to try it. We are slowing down inside the atmosphere, but not, I mean, just tiny, tiny bit. So I think we should be able to still make that rendezvous happen. Um, I think. I've never tried it. Well, I have tried it, but not intentionally. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to go ahead and do this burn. And then we will uh, try to make our maneuver, despite the fact that we tee dip our toe into the atmosphere of Kerbin there. So, just dip our toe in just a hair, but I think we'll be okay. Alright, so let's go ahead and do this burn. And, uh, should be just fine. There we go. Let's just see if we can just ease her in here. Just ease it in. There we go. Beautiful. Love it. Love it. Okay. So now we're at point four. Unfortunately, I think it will it will decrease a little because our periapsis is going to dip down and we'll lose a little bit of speed. But uh, let's see if we can warp around here. Just like that. We'll set this to target. And uh, let's see what happens. After we dip our toe into the atmosphere. Um, yep. Stopped our warp here. We're going to go down to about 67,000. And so. We should see this increase probably. Yeah. Starting to creep up now the separation. Because he is still in full orbit. We are not. We had to change our um, our course so that our orbit intersected with his. I could, what I could have done alternately if I was patient enough, which I am not patient enough, would be lower my my uh, apoapsis and then um, try to intersect in a in another location that uh, did not require us to dip into the atmosphere but like I said it's kind of hard when his his periapsis is like at 74,000 so it's a little difficult to uh, to really get in there and uh, have your orbits intersect in a way that you don't have to orbit like 10 days or something <laughs> I mean if you have to that's you know that's that's part of it but all right, we're, we're looking pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and go retrograde here. We're going to kill our relative speeds. And then we should be able to make a nice intersection. Real ladylike. Okay. I try to get within like 30 seconds of the target before I do our speed change. You can see it's a, it took quite a bit of relative speed change to, uh, to get us where I wanted to be. That's because I had such a high apoapsis from the station still. All right. Let's just go ahead and kill this speed here, speed differential. There we go. All right, so now we are the closest we're going to be probably. So let's just go ahead and burn now towards the target. And there we go. Our intersection should be at... 1.1 currently. Let's see if we can get that a little bit better here. How about a nice point two? How about point one? Boom! 
<laughs> You're seeing it. Okay. And our periapsis has been corrected due to us basically matching his orbit. Is basically what we just did. I'm sure if you've watched me this far, you understand rendezvous, at least in a uh, general fashion. Okay. We're going to go ahead and get ready to do our retrograde burn here. Let's just get him as close as possible. That way the guy doesn't have to fly as far on EVA. Down to zero, please. There we go. All right, let's switch over to him. He is in, looks like a planetary base module. Or she, rather. She's a scientist. That's good. All right. So, she's with the R&D company. Bye-bye. See ya. Turn your RCS on. There you go. All right. And that thing is going to be destroyed. Okay, so we're going to fly over to the module. Get on board. Get in the escape pod. Escape down to Kerbin. And all will be well. Okay. Let's just slowly roll there, buddy. As deuce. As deuce. It's an interesting name. Uh, if you do have a name suggestion for this female scientist, let me have it. I'll be happy to uh, change her name or we can leave it as is. Uh, I've got just about all, I think I've got all of the other requests done. The, the last one, I believe, was a Han Kerbin. I got that one done. So, uh, so yeah, we, uh, got all the name suggestions so far. Stop, 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 stop. Fly over there. Alright. Why don't you fly it up? I, I don't like it whenever I can't get my orientation right here. And they won't grab the ladder. <laughs> grab it. Grab it. Up. Oh, there we go. Alright. And we are on board. Let's see what we can do to land in the correct place. Oh my, we are there right now. We're doing it. Let's do it. Let's do a retrograde burn quickly. Quickly. Orbital retrograde burn. We gotta drop. We gotta get to the space center. Oh yeah, we can do this. Got plenty of fuel. Plenty of fuel. So we're gonna bring her on in. This time we're going to land actually at the station. Believe me. We can do it. We can do it. Alright. We got our contract complete. Excuse me. A little extra money. And um. Yee boy. What are we going to do for the next episode? I think uh, we'll do something for the moon. Maybe uh, send up another mission to the moon. I would love to set up a moon satellite, but I don't think we have... I mean, not a satellite station. I don't think we have a mission for that. Well, nothing saying we don't have to... We can only do what we have missions for, you know? So I could take what we already have um, built for Kerbin and Minmus up to... Uh, I can combine them into one massive rocket, take it to the moon, put it into orbit, and then... Uh, go from there and then start doing some missions down to the moon to get some science oh science we need to unlock the rest of the tree so there's that all right beautiful i think that um this should put us right at the base here let's see what we got here mm -hmm. It's looking pretty good. I'm not going to eject the uh, engine quite yet because uh, that slows us down too much, I think. So I might be able to just use the parachutes as is, actually, which would be nice. And we'll have to see how hot it gets. 
if it starts getting too hot, I may have to eject it. Oh my. We're coming in quick. We're coming in quick. That was a shallow. That was a shallow re entry. I'm going to have to eject it. There you go. But we're close. We're close to the we're close to the base this time. We are close to the base this time. No problem. No problem. Just, just keep drifting before I pop the shoots. Keep drifting. Ah, oh, we were so close. So close. Still undershot just a little. Just a tiny bit. Oh man. I mean that's pretty good, but I guess I better slow down. I guess I better slow it down. We should see the rocket part crash down here pretty quick. Somewhere. There it is. It's coming down. Boom. It didn't even blow up. That's funny. Okay. Yet whenever I land my <laughs> my Minmus base, I switch to the thing that's already landed and it blows up. So yeah, it's, that's Kerbal for you. That's the Kraken. He'll. That's what he does. All right. So we're gonna come on down and uh, we'll get this lady debriefed and. Uh, get her added to the crew so i hope you enjoyed this episode if you did throw me some likes leave me some comments and as always subscribe to my channel i will see you guys next time bye we're both way by the window vaguely looking down at their song and hoping possibly jebediah will come home with some wrong from Crowds gather as